Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore back again with another Woody's Original Clam Lube brand hot sauce review for you guys. Now, I believe this is one of their newer ones. This is their Sea Ghost Vivacious Verde. I just really love the labels on here. Uh, make sure you check out my first review. That is Raquel, uh, the lovely mermaid that is on every one of these bottles, but just gorgeous looking labels. Uh, Awesome, awesome marketing. Uh, I've said this on my first review. Check out their website. It's really well done. Get the uh, story about Woody. Uh, just uh, really uh, laid out well. You can actually pull up the bottles and look at them in 3D. So it's very well done. But let's go ahead and get into this uh, potion number five. It says here, Woody's potion number five delivers big rosemary lime infused flavor with ghost pepper. And our secret enlivening mojo of plenty to let you know it's crisp and kicking. Number five's uh, feisty mix of succulent gusto lights up your longing for fresh picante verde. What you eat makes you hot. As flavor zealots, we want to enliven your eats. And Clam Lou brings out the very best flavors in all your fave foods. You'll feel better and look better, way woody. All right, ingredients, <coughs> excuse me, ingredients, uh, the sodium is only five milligrams, but here's the ingredients on this one. Um, onion, lime juice, red wine vinegar, organic brown sugar, chili peppers, which are poblano, jalapeno, and ghost pepper, garlic, lemon, salt, and spices. Just an awesome sounding uh, list of ingredients. Now, the first thing that kind of bothered me when I looked at this um, I just think it's a little bit too loose, uh, too thin a hot sauce to be a Verde. Um, but I'll go ahead and say it now. Um, the flavor <laughs> makes up for that. But I uh, just uh, wish this one wasn't so um, liquidy. I mean, just a little bit too thin uh, because the, the flavor on this is so well done. I just wish it was kind of a little bit thicker you know, like a you know regular Verde sauce. Verde sauces don't have to be super, super thick and chunky, uh, but just, uh, you know, expecting that. I thought it'd be better if it was a little bit thicker than, than what this one is. Actually, it didn't come with a flow restrictor, and uh, I'll put one on here because you'll make a mess with it being so thin like this if you don't have it. But the aroma on this stuff, what I immediately get is onions, and then you just get a citrus blast that is so unique, uh, so inviting so savory something different i guess it's that rosemary infused that's what the side of the bottle has says here rosemary lime infused um flavor uh, the ingredients of course just say the lime juice but uh, there's something different about it uh, you get the green you know uh, type aroma but the onions uh you know the first ingredient so you're getting a nice awesome blast of uh, uh, um, onion aroma does it smell vinegary? I mean, and, and it's really cool that they're using a you know different vinegar, red wine vinegar. A little bit of sweetness, you know, coming from the uh, organic brown sugar, and then of course uh, the uh, the peppers, you know, with the jalapeno and the ghost pepper. But a nice citrus note, but uh, really savory and onions, very very nice. Okay, let's go ahead and put it on a spoon. I'm going to go ahead and leave this on because I do, do believe it comes out pretty easy, as you can see. And when you see this one, um, you know, you get, it's very loose, very liquidy, but you can see the uh, pieces of the peppers and the ingredients in here. All right, here we go. Wow. Now, the flavor is just awesome. I love the flavor on this stuff. You get a nice sweetness, but it's something unique about it. It's not vinegary at all. Um, it's not salty at all, but it's just something different and that onion flavor really comes up But I think it's that uh, like they say that rosemary Which is an herb that I happen to absolutely love rosemary infused lime juice. So it's giving it a nice really different citrus flavor um, Definitely get some spiciness. Um, it's got ghost peppers in there, but it's still pretty mild on my 1 to 10 scale uh, But love the poblano pepper one of my favorites jalapenos and then that ghost pepper um, the garlic, you also get the garlic as well, and then there's lemon and then the uh, salt and spices at the end. So, you know, but up front, onions, 
really uh, nice, unique, um, you know, citrus aroma coming from that, or flavor as well, coming from that lime juice. It's just really, really good. And it's not a strong, tart lime. Uh, There's something different about it that is really, really good. So I love to put uh, jalapeno sauces, verde type sauces on eggs. So let me show you a picture of what I did with this one. I put this on a cheese and scallion omelet. Um, also had some my favorite Wright's brand uh, uh, applewood smoked bacon, so it's just really, really good. Um, I think I, the flavor on this one, I'm going to give it a strong 8 out of 10 for flavor. Uh, I just wish it wasn't so loose. Um, I think it you know, would be better you know, thickened up a little bit because all those flavors is just incredible. Heat, um, they've got it listed 3, three out of 5 peppers. I'm going to give it a 3 out of 10 for heat. For a ghost pepper sauce, it is very, very mild. You just get a little bit of a, you know, a burn going on, but not much at all, especially for chili heads. But awesome flavor, another winner. Um, great job. Thank you, Mike, for sending this. I really do appreciate it. Everybody check this company out. You can find them on Facebook at Woody's uh, Original Brand, Original Clam Lube Brand, and the website is clamlube.com. Link will be down in the description. They've got eight amazing, awesome flavor profiles uh, with the names that are really, really cool. So make sure you check it out. All right. So thanks for watching, guys. Stay tuned for lots more. And until the next time, enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.